Hi guys, this is Bernadette and I'm not making a fitness video or a motivation video. Um, I did miss last Motivation Monday because I had a migraine. Um, I just have to let that one slide. Um, I'm not going to stress about it. So I'm making a video related to Spikey and how I get Spikey to take his vitamins. Um, I actually had bought this aqua uh, turtle block, right? It's this pink block thing. And actually, it's these. So I would put one in this tank, right? And it will just kind of start to sizzle. Um, and it doesn't uh, completely just disappear. It just starts the sizzling process and it will slowly shrink over time. And I mean, like, it could be, I don't know. I mean, I had the same one that I kept putting, even after I changed this tank, I had to keep putting back in the tank. But what I realized is these were just terrible because, yes, they're calcium, but apparently your turtle's supposed to kind of nip at it and maybe eat pieces off of it. And he did not even care it was there. So he never touched it. The fish ate off of it, okay? Um, so it would just sit there and sizzle, but what it did is it was just destroying my tank. It was making the tank so disgustingly um, murky, you know, cloudy, but just really slimy. And it was just horrific. And I found out it was because of that. So I had to get rid of that. So this is how I give him his calcium and vitamins. So these are the multivitamins that I use. Um, it's herpetivite, herp, herptivite, herp, herp, I don't know. Okay, multivitamins with beta carotene. All right. So this I give him like every other day. I'm not giving, I'm not making these today. I will be making the calcium ones and I'm going to make them right here to show you how I make them. Um, and this is calcium with uh, vitamin D. These are both made by a company called RepCal. Um, they're a little, they were the most expensive vitamins, so I got them because I found out, you know, that they are really good, plus you do get what you pay for. I want to make sure that Spikey has the best stuff possible, especially since, you know, it's not like a normal domesticated animal like a cat or a dog. Um, not that, you know, I would give them crap either, but you know, it's something I found outside and that I want to make sure I do everything in my power to give him a good, healthy life. So I'm going to be making some calcium uh, worms. So I have here his mealworms and then I have what says calcium worms. So this is... So I just ran out. I gave him his last calcium worms yesterday, you know, and when I dug in there, it was the last ones. So there's no more in here. So I'm just double checking. Nope, this is all gone. So I'm just going to get rid of that one. Okay, give me one second. All right, let me get another paper towel. All right. So... This isn't like a really professional video. This is just me doing my thing. Okay, so I have two boxes of regular mealworms right here. I'm gonna work out of this box. Okay, I have the least ones in there. All right, so first things first. I'm gonna take out a certain amount of worms that I'm gonna use for Yeah. <laughs> Say hi. Yeah, it's gross. I'm touching them. I'm picking up my hands. Never thought I would actually do this. Um, let's see here. I'm going to put this like this so you can see what I'm doing. Okay. So it's three. So I'm going to say... So, I give him approximately like two at a time. So, two, four, six. Um, 
So this is his main food. He loves the mealworms. And some of them are really big, like regular sized worms. And I'm thinking he's not going to be able to eat this, it's too big. He engulfs them like they're nothing now. Like literally engulfs them. So, right, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six. And a couple of extra in case he loses them. Because sometimes I put the worm in with the, thong, with the tongs and he'll grab it and sometimes he'll drop it. And then it will somehow work its way. Sometimes it's still wiggling and moving in between the friggin' rocks and he loses it. And, he does, and he's like looking at me like, I don't have a worm anymore. So I have to put extra ones in there. Oopsies. Um... All right, that should be good. Um, all right, so I got my worms. You can see them. Oh boy. See, if I don't act fast, I'm telling you, I've caught them literally trying to climb up the sides up and over. So I gotta work fast. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take some of the shavings because they eat the shavings, right? It's also, it's for bedding, these little shavings. So I'm talking about this for anybody that may find a little baby snapping turtle and want to keep it. Um, or maybe just any turtle, but, so the shavings is actually designed, they put the worms in there because it's bedding, but it's also something that, that they actually eat. Oh man, I forgot to get my lettuce, my spinach. <laughs> so I might have to pause this. Okay, I might have to get some shavings out of this one because it's so hard to grab shavings and I grab worms. I am going to end up grabbing worms. So, all right, so here's the deal. Get some more shavings in there. I'll keep my eyes on the, my eye on the worms because they're moving all over the place over there. All right. So I got my shavings, okay, and, nope, not multivitamins, calcium, okay, it's a powder, so as you can see, right, it's a powder, and I'm going to put some of this calcium in the shavings, all right, then I'm going to take the worms and I'm gonna put them in there. So they say, you know, sprinkle, I could sprinkle the calcium and the vitamins over his food, like his pellets and stuff, but I don't feel that works too well because the second, like his pellets and other food, like hit the water, it just comes out into the water, you know, if he doesn't eat it like immediately. And I tried and it didn't seem like it works really well. All right. So then I'm going to put a little bit more shavings on top of them. So now I got the shavings and the worms all I don't know if you can see that all right with the little bit of calcium I put in there I'm gonna put a little bit more uh shavings because they need the shavings all right and then I'm gonna put a tiny bit more calcium so here's the deal This is how this works. They're all set. So calcium. So I know that's the calcium worms. That's gonna go in the fridge. These are his regular worms, and these are his regular worms. I actually just made a list of things I'm about to go to the store, things I need to get, and I put down mealworms, but I think I'm still good. I don't think I need any. There's plenty in there. So I do the same thing for the vitamins, but I have a 
thing like this that says multivitamin in the fridge right now still fills with worms, so I don't need to do that. And I do the exact same thing. So what happens is the worms, now I didn't bring my lettuce in here. I'll also put, I'm going to put some lettuce in here. Okay, I'm sorry, I should have, it's just like uh, lettuce, like romaine lettuce, um, spinach leaves. I think I have spinach leaves and mixed greens, something like that in my fridge. And I just take a couple of pieces and I put it in there and I stir it all in there too. And the worms will eat the spinach leaves, which also has nutrients because my spiky is going to be eating these worms. So I want to feed the worms well. I want to feed them well with nutrients and nutrition. So the calcium and vitamins and the spinach or uh, romaine lettuce. And then spiky eats the worms. So the worms are going to ingest. So the, the calcium is not only on top of their bodies. So if it does hit the water and um, washes away, it's okay. Because the worms are going to be eating and ingesting that calcium. So therefore, then it's going to go into my spiky. Then um, anything else the worms eat, like the spinach leaves and stuff like that, is also nutrients. It's going to keep them thriving. It's going to keep them growing. It's going to keep the worms healthy so they can make my spiky healthy. And there you go. So these will go in the fridge. And he hasn't had his calcium today. In fact, there's a way I can actually show a feeding. I can maybe record that. I could try to get that on and show um, him eating these, except they didn't ingest their, um, I'll do that later or tomorrow because I want to give the worms a chance to eat that calcium. So that's it, but I will make that video. All right, so this is part of Spiky TV. <laughs> Take care. Okay, so here I'm about to give a feeding and I'm gonna give Spiky some vi uh, some calcium worms and then some regular worms. Right Spiky, you ready for your worms? He says yes. Okay. So I'm gonna take out one and two right there. And then this still cold from the fridge. They liven up in a little bit, so. Okay, so two, three. Okay, we'll start with that to get it on film. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, he's a lively one, look at that. Okay, <laughs> come on Spiky, you ready for your little calcium? Make sure you get really close. Come on, Spiky. He's looking at you like, what the hell? Get up over top, like, yeah. Get more so you can get him. Ready? He's gonna get closer. There he goes. Get close. He's eating it. Mm -hmm. Yep. He's eating it. Mm -hmm. Make sure you get mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Did he drop it? Yep. Is it stuck behind the rock? Oh man, hold on. Is it in his mouth? Yep. Ah, oh, yeah. crap. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, see, now we really he really lost it. He got it. No, he's got it. He can get it. He got it. Oh my God, he got it. He sucked it in. He's, an, he's a beast. Look yeah, there you go. Well, Keep that's it up. a scary picture. All right, keep it still, we don't have so much shade. Keep it, stay it. All right, back up, I'm gonna give him a second one. I know how long it takes for him to swallow. He's quick, you ready? Here's the second one. Come on, Spiky, don't drop this one. Well, normally he's not in this corner, and we have a lot more. Yeah, baby, try not to shake. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, baby. He's such a good boy. He's such a good boy. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't he so cute? Mm -hmm. Okay, so... 
So that's all I'm going to video. Um, I'm going to feed him the rest of these worms now. Um, this was the lettuce leaves, mixed greens that I put in there. So he just got his calcium. He got his calcium for the day, and he's going to have nice, strong, and healthy shell and be nice and healthy. So let me get this other food in him. He's waiting for it. Thanks for watching Spiky TV. And thanks for the help of Larry. You're welcome. <laughs> for recording it. All right. He's getting his calcium. He's in there now. Look what I got for Spiky, for Spiky, for Spiky. Look what I got for Spiky. You can't wait to eat. You love to eat. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> You're like, give it to me. Give it to me. You're so happy now, right? Yeah. If he can talk, he'd say, all right, put the camera down and feed me. <laughs> feed me, human. Feed me. Look at him. Yeah. <gasps> Mommy's going to feed you. Yeah. You ready? I don't know if I can do this. Hold on. Okay. <gasps> Here we go, here we go. Looky, 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 looky. He is happy. He is happy. Yeah. After all that stress of being in a Tupperware, and look at you, you're in a clean tank again, just like two days ago. <laughs> All right, you get one more. All right, bye-bye.